Okay, so here we are and I'm ready to give you an example. I'm gonna snap my fingers and I'm going to be magically transported to a hallway here at ACS. Okay, so see, it actually looks like I'm in a hallway at ACS. It's a believable special effect, okay? But if, and that's because the film I shot of the hallway, I used a tripod. The film I'm shooting right now of me, I use a tripod. Now let's go and break those rules in the next shot. Okay, so now this is being shot by someone who's trying to stay as steady as possible, but it's imp oh, they're wiggling on purpose now. But you can see um, when I have the background here that the illusion is lost. Even though the background was shot with a tripod, it just doesn't look quite right. I mean, it's close, but it's not quite right, okay? Okay, and I'm back in this example. So for, for this example, um, you can see now the background was shot without a tripod. So even though I'm rock solid steady with a tripod here in Studio B, the other footage doesn't look real because it wasn't shot on a tripod. And that's an example of how it is. I hope this now helps you make sense of how to use a green screen. Okay, so just to review, you've got to have a well-lit green screen. The subject's got to be well-lit. You've got to be a distance away from the green screen and everything needs to be shot on a tripod. Understand?